Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. About a month or so ago, I did a video reviewing the new Clean and Clear Watermelon Collection. A lot of you really wanted me to do a review on the Lemon Collection Clean and Clear also has. So in today's video, I am going to be reviewing that collection and giving you guys all my thoughts about it and showing you how to use it. Before we start the video, go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe if you're new because I would love to have you. Also, make sure you have your post notifications turned on so you are notified every time I upload a video. I upload new videos every single Tuesday and Friday. Let's start the video. I'm going to start by putting my hair back out of my face. The first product I'm going to be using is the gel cleanser, and I'm going to be removing my makeup with that. This cleanser cuts through oils, dissolves dirt, and I really like this cleanser because it removes mostly all my makeup very easily. With a washcloth, I'm going to be wiping all the cleanser off my face. Just like that, my makeup is gone. Now I'm going to be using the Lemon Cleansing Wipes. I'm going to just wipe my whole face and remove any extra dirt or makeup that didn't come off with the gel cleanser. Clean and Clear also has a lemon toner that I have used before in the past but I'm currently out of and can't go to the store because of the COVID-19. Stay at home everyone and stay safe. And here's the wipe after wiping my whole face. As you can see, I did remove some more makeup, but for the most part, all of the makeup came off with the gel cleanser. Okay, now I'm going to be using the exfoliating slices. These are little lemon-shaped pads. I use these pads mainly on my nose or where I have blackheads. I also use them on breakout spots. I found that these exfoliating pads help with my acne. I don't break out that much, but when I do, I just use these pads and the acne is gone. Now lastly, I'm going to be using the Zesty Scrub. I only use this about once or twice a week, depending on my skin. I really like this scrub. It works great and leaves my skin so soft. I 
I do actually prefer this lemon scrub over the watermelon scrub. I did find out that my skin is more sensitive to the watermelon scrub. Now I'm just going to be removing the scrub with a wet washcloth. Now I'm going to be moisturizing my face. You always want to make sure you apply some lotion after cleansing your face. In all honesty, I really do love these products. I have tried a lot of different skincare products, and these just work really good for me and my skin. Like I have said before, I tend to have sensitive skin, and these products still work really great for me. So if you're looking for some new skincare, I definitely would recommend these products. Okay guys, if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.